G'day, I'm just going to show you some um, cigar boxes that I've made. Cigar box guitars. Uh, this one here, this is one I made for my son. It's He's only four, so it's a really short one. Just made it out of an axe handle, an old fretboard from an um, old acoustic. And the cigar box sound hole. It's got a uh, piezo pickup in it. And uh, yeah, he just plugs that in and it goes hard to. I don't mind playing it either. It's a pretty good lap steel sort of slide. That one. And um, this one here. This is one I'm giving away this weekend to a friend whose 60th birthday. Um, I've just finished this one. It's got a. Uh, it's actually a block splitter handle. That's the neck that I've um, split in half with a table saw and just a piece of brass pipe as the bridge that I've split in half. Uh, threaded pipe, penny there to hold the strings, and a I don't know some sort of flash 50 cent piece there that I drilled a hole in the middle and and put the um, the pickup in. It's just got a piezo pickup, as you'll see inside. Just in there, um, I cut a bit of a gap between the. Uh, and the neck and the top of the box there so that the sound can resonate through the box but it doesn't as well as I would have liked but I'm figuring it out um, just a couple of uh, hair strainers for your sink it's the sound holes um, I cut my own frets in I bought myself a fret saw from um, Stuart Mac and some fret wire. Very handy site on the internet, Stuart Mac, for making your own guitars. Just a bolt as the nut, and I ground it down on uh, on the bottom there just to get the right height. Um, the strings are a little bit higher, so you can play slide a bit easier, a bit higher off the. Uh, off the fret wire. You can always take that nut off and uh, grind it down if you want them want the frets closer and you can grind the bridge down too if you want them a bit closer. Uh, 